That's right. It's Paris Hilton after the face aging app. Take a big drink in. Yes, I brought my chihuahua on stage. I've become that kind of white woman. I think the outfit needs a little bit of attention. Such a supermodel. I am very well aware that I look like a Christmas present that became a stripper to put itself through college. I'm kidding, I can't breastfeed. These are leased. I call them the Property Brothers. They're nearly identical, they're Canadian, they're popular, but what's really going on? I don't even know what would come out of one of these. My best guess, glitter. <laughs> All right, drink it in, I can't. You have no idea how happy I am I'm doing a show with actual live people. I have not been in front of this many people since my colonic, because I live tweet them. And there's an intern. And here's what's annoying about COVID. It was already so unbelievably annoying to get remotely sick in LA, because those same gurus would descend and say, oh, you're not feeling well? Okay, are you taking, are you taking echinacea? Are you taking echinacea for that? Some vitamin C powder? What about ginger shots? Are you taking some elderberry gummies? Are you doing that? B12 injections, have you tried that? Oil of oregano, it tastes like a nightmare, but it's really gonna help. Olive leaf, what about, yes, yeah, some vitamin C again? Did we already go over that? Okay, what about some lemon and that, some apple cider vinegar? Can you take, you know, you should go to Whole Foods and you get a little bit of dried red clay and the placenta of a goat and then you just put it on each one of your chakras, but not during Mercury retrograde. Oh my God, if that's the case, then just take the crispy chest hairs of a Greek man and put it in a blend with the sperm of a centaur and... No, bitch. NyQuil. Have you tried NyQuil chilled? It's like a fine dessert wine. I'm going to do an impression against your will. That's right. This is Mickey Mouse having an orgasm. Which reminds me during the pandemic, um, fellas, a lot of you seem to be confusing Messenger with Tinder. The way my dad used to confuse casinos with a day job. Oh yeah, you're looking at a woman with more daddy issues than a small town knocked up stripper, Luke Skywalker and the children from Succession. That's what's happening here. Just so you know what you're dealing with. <laughs> We do an online shopping. I guess that's all we can do now, right? Online shopping. Yeah, I, uh, I did all mine at American Voodoo Doll. It's great. Got my niece an Easy Bake Coven. It's, uh, it's not sexist because she's gender druid. That was a lot of puns. So many puns in a row, like a pun gangbang. It all happened. So much to drink in at once. I, I want to, oh, thank you. Oh my goodness, look, champagne. I love champagne, it's just like me. Light, bubbly, goes down easy. <laughs> and I don't know about you, but like, I think we're all the same approaching quarantine. Like we have these great intentions like, oh, quarantine, that's gonna be some me time. I'm gonna reflect, I'm gonna do a lot of yoga and meditating, you know, find my authentic self, maybe write that novel do online Zumba courses every day. I'm gonna do classes. Meanwhile, cut to day five, I'm just lying on the couch with a warm bottle of Hennessy, wearing a stormtrooper's helmet, and masturbating to a Murdoch Mysteries marathon. <laughs> Siri, am I pretty? Am I pretty, Siri? At one point, I just found myself trying to put together like a homemade batch of Botox using almond milk, crazy glue, and essential oils. <laughs> it works. It's not okay. <laughs> I don't go to the anal bleacher myself. I don't have the budget. Not when there are crest white strips. So uncomfortable. <laughs> Does the trick, though. The billionaires are laughing. <laughs> we just human trafficked her in the last five minutes. Bring me another warm kitten to wipe my ass with. We're billionaires. Excuse me while I get my drink. Hang on. Jesus. 
questions? Oh, don't worry about it. Like the Matrix, I'll do it this way. There's a photo op. Oh, here comes a bullet. Oh. That's what I thought we were fighting for, that we can dress however we want, right? Like Billie Eilish can dress like a Batman villain if she'd like to. Lizzo can show her big magnificent ass if she wants to. It's not hurting anyone. If I want to wear an outfit that has less material than Dane Cook's act, I can. <laughs> That's another big LA thing. You've got to go on a cleanse, Carla. You should do a cleanse. You should really do a cleanse. I'm like, bitch, what if toxins are the only things holding me together? I cannot <laughs> risk that during a pandemic. I can't. I wasn't such a lady. 